So I need to show you the thing I'm working on out here. I've always wanted a little house inside a tree, but it turns out I don't know how to make one inside a tree. I can make one on the ground, right there. You know all of this right here? We dug all that wood out. Now it's a roof. And I just found that cardboard. If you just go on inside here, pretty cool. It's pretty sturdy too. Working on it. There's Corbin. Th that's what our fort looks like. Yeah. We tried to make one. Still working on it right here. Here's some of the wood. Here's another There's stick some to wood put. planks back here, like those. Here's another stick to put to the fort. Hmm, that's a good one. But a good stick. Yeah, Rolling. we're going ice skating soon on that. No. Yeah. That's what it looks like. Tell me Whoa. and the subscribers how you think I should do it. I feel pretty, oh so pretty. I took the time to get ready to the A and that's really good, I can say. Ouch! Oh my goodness, its arm is broken. <laughs> Did you see it? Uh -oh. <laughs> there was a statue of liberty that was a blow up one and its arm was like. <laughs> so today we are going ice skating! Woo! Who's excited for ice skating? I know we've been ice skating together. I don't it remember must when have been when we were engaged because I do not remember going ice skating with you. Because I remember Play thinking station. ice skating is a luxury because I'm always pregnant or nursing with yeah. a baby and I either, I either can't go or I can't go or I can't go. And now that I'm used to not going, I'm like, do I really want to go ice skating? I don't know. I'm sure I'll enjoy it once we get there, but right now I'm kind of like, meh. Hey, Becca. What? I put on your favorite Brad Paisley song. <laughs> oh my goodness, we have the tiniest little ice skates. They're so cute. Are you excited? Yeah. Good. All right, you're getting your boots on. saw your face I could feel my heart finishing a race so this love could start now you're in my arms I'm not letting I'm you not go, letting go. Jesse. And I'm Anna. Anna, thanks for you guys. Good to meet you. <laughs> cool. And they decided to share this with us because they desperately needed we it. We did need it. <laughs> Only going higher, baby, with you. Lately, I pray and say you're the reason I, I know I can fly, fly the greatest. You are the greatest. You are the greatest. Love, love, yeah. So I. Charlie wanted to take a Doritos break, so we're hanging out eating chips. Okay, that was really, really fun. How do you like this lighting? How do you like my name? How do you like my name? I like chips. <laughs> okay, that works. That was really fun. I think that I am not used to ice skating. My ankles are yelling at me a little. They're like, hey! 
why'd you do that to me? <laughs> you jerk. <laughs> that was really fun. We met a whole bunch of viewers there. That was so cool. So we met a whole bunch of you guys and you were very helpful. Thank you for helping the kids on the ice because they really needed it. And also thank you for sharing your little blue thingity that helped Ellie to skate and not fall on her face. That was nice. And that was really fun. We had a good time. That was I'll a good go time. We'll go back again soon for sure. Oh my goodness. I almost broke my back. Terrible. Oh, that's better. James said he almost broke his back because he fell on the on the side, like he grabbed onto the side, but his body bent towards the ground like I think overall though the kids had a good time. Did you guys have a good time? Yeah! yeah! Do you want to do it again sometime when we all get blue thingies? Yeah! yeah! <laughs> <laughs> they really wanted one of those, but it was so, so busy. I couldn't busy. believe how many people there were. Saturday. I think I have been there before. Actually. Oh really? Yeah, and it amazes me how many people there were. I know. I was like, wow. And there were some like actual like pretty good figure skaters there, and they were like skating and doing basically going in circles around everybody else. And Every time I see someone like that, I just imagine they're probably a professional. Yeah. yeah. I'm like, wow. <laughs> I've always wanted to do that, but I don't think I have the discipline or the time. Yeah. That's the. <laughs> Especially the time, and yeah. I don't think I have the determination either. <laughs> yeah. So I really don't want to do it. <laughs> so we need to run some errands, right? Where are yes. we going now? We need to run to our old house. What else? There was another place you wanted and to go. And we need to, I want to get so badly. I have wanted this my entire life, and I've never gotten it. A quad where it's uh, scriptures. Oh, that's right. Ooh. So I want scriptures where it's the Bible and the Book of Mormon in one book, not in one book, but put together so it's like in the same page, in the same binding or whatever. And then I want to also get a new scripture case. The only scripture set that I've ever had, I got when I was eight years old and I have used it a lot. Probably should have used it more than I have, but <laughs> I didn't pick it out. I was given it as a gift Speaking for my baptism. Look, it's a temple! I was given it as a gift for my baptism when I turned eight years old. I think it's time for me to get one that I'm excited about, get a new one that I am looking forward to reading out of, and I'm just so excited! What? <laughs> what is it? <laughs> it's a package we got that says the beach house. What, is it bad? Did you order this? Maybe, I don't even know what it is. You said maybe. I have no idea what it is. Okay, well then I'll just have to hop out of the car and then I'll hop back in in just a second. I want to see it. You will. Okay. Now everybody, look on that side of the car. Everybody look out the other side. I'm watching you guys. Don't you dare. Keep your eyes over to the other side. <laughs> what the heck? What is that thing? A chicken! What the heck is that thing? Did I scare you guys? Did you order that? I have no idea where that came from, or what? <laughs> what the heck? I have no idea why we have a chicken head. <laughs> well, um, I don't. <laughs> I don't either. <laughs> you should let James wear it or Charlie or something. Let's go. That's so ugly. <laughs> Here, we have it back. I'm gonna grab the package on the All right, Jamie, you want to put it on? All right. But you have to say, burk, burk, burk. <laughs> Do you think maybe we got the wrong package? <laughs> yes. <laughs> Terrifying. <laughs> Do we totally shock you? I was like, what the chicken? <laughs> <laughs> Becca, we got that in the mail today at the P.O. Box. Really? We have no idea who sent it to us. Really? We just randomly we have a chicken head now. <laughs> That's cool. Did that, <laughs> did that shock you? <laughs> yeah. We're just coming to grab a few things. Here. Someone <laughs> came and framed in where the microwave is going to go around the oven. The oven's set in there a little bit nicer too. That is so nice looking. Why do we do these things when we live in the house? <laughs> I was thinking that same thing. Right? Oh, so you, you wanted these curtains. these curtains. I want them. Okay, take the curtains then. So hard to do this with a chicken in my hand. <laughs> I decided a little while back. Okay, cool. 
I wanted to do something nice for Michael. So I decided that, you know, our honeymoon phase is over. We don't really write love notes to each other so much anymore. Things have changed in our relationship. We still love each other extremely and we're never going to split up or anything like that. I love him so much. I decided that I wanted to do a challenge to do one nice thing for him a day that is out of my way, not the normal things that I would do, just to show that I love him. Mm. I think he's in the other room listening. Mm. No, he's not. Anyways, today I'm going to make him pie. Homemade pumpkin pie and apple pie because I think that he absolutely loves it and he, he always asks me for it and I never give it to him, so. Apple pie and pumpkin pie it is. I've got my pie all put together and now I just need to put the crust on top. <laughs> hey, what's this song? <laughs> what's this song? <laughs> I'm wishing no, that it's not right. It's not right. It's not right. It's not right. cream. Look at how much is already gone. We got some apple over here and another full pumpkin that hasn't been touched yet. That one tastes like the cast iron. I don't know why. Yucky. You're too good at that, Ryan. <laughs> <laughs> Ryan, I feel like that's the move that makes you the happiest. Ryan! <laughs> He's just being funny doing that. We're watching Yu Yu Hakusho right now. Yu Yu Hakusho is an anime show that was made like in the 90s, 1993. Michael has watched it five times. Favorite anime. Absolutely my favorite. Just so you know, Michael doesn't watch hardly anything more than once after he watches it. He likes to watch things one time and then move on. Weird, huh? He'll watch it again if it's been a really long time, but Yu Yu Hakusho, he knows it really well. He's seen it five times. Like, <laughs> And that's the whole series, like the whole, all of the different seasons and everything. And there's a lot of seasons. Like Except seasons. if you like anime, watch Yu Yu Hakusho. It's, it's a My pretty favorite. cool show. It's almost like adult, it's an adult anime. It's not, I mean, not that it has anything like Adult, but you wouldn't want your kids to watch it. I watched it when I was a teenager. Yeah, it, it has swear words. It has swear words. It has a couple a inappropriate, little, little tiny inappropriate things. But like, anyways, it's it basically is a really well written story. I really like it. And the last time I watched it was when me and Michael were very first, first, first married. He was like, "You have to watch this," and I was like, Ugh, "Anime." Ugh. And then I watched it, and then I was like, "Oh, guess it's okay." And now I'm like, "Yeah, it's so good." <laughs> How do you like your pie? Mmm, made with love. So good. It really good. was. It was made with love. I made that specifically for you. You know that day that you were gone and I was like, you have to take all the kids so I can get stuff done. Well, I made pie crust while you were gone and it's been sitting in the fridge ever since then. So hopefully we don't all die. Just kidding. <laughs> no, it's it's fine in the fridge. I had to make pie because I made that pie crust a long time ago because I wanted to surprise you. And then you got home too soon and I wasn't able to do it all in one day. But that's okay. When we were kids, just hanging at the playground.